Good morning, everyone. Now the next lecture related to your uh, MS uh, PowerPoint. Uh, so, uh, like in this video, what I'm going to tell you, I'm telling uh, you about like how to add text within this uh, like MS PowerPoint, right? So, first of all, what you do, you just give one name to it by saving it means uh, by going into this file menu you just save your file right you just save your file and if you want to create the copy of it then what you do you just click on save as option and the same copy will be created at uh, at the location where you want to save it right okay so as uh, like i have opened one slide that is this ms powerpoint lecture number two now uh, like this is what this is one kind of uh, like uh, one slide that is title slide and i have taken uh, one heading into it that is introduction to ms powerpoint right now what you have to do for example you want to add some more slides into it so what you do you just click on uh, this option that is new slide right and you just choose like what type of slide you want to add within this so you just click on title and contain part after that what you do you just add the title within it you just add the title within it for example the title is introduction to point right now if you want to add some text within it then what you do is just start writing within it for example powerpoint is a presentation software package software package right and with the help of this with the help of this we can add we can uh, add or create we can create slideshows easily right for example this is the content which you want to add in this uh, like powerpoint presentation right uh, like uh, here one red line is coming so what you do you just right click on it and you just uh, like choose the correct one the correct spelling just choose it after that like here again there is one like i have to choose uh, the p capital in case of point also so this is what this is a content which you want to add in your above one slide right now for example uh, you want to add one shape within it so what you do you just uh, like choose any shape which you want to add choose any of the shape for example you want to add the shape okay what you do you just draw it okay you just draw it and after that you just uh, like uh, choose the color which you want to do in this for example you want to fill this shape with this color right now for example you want to add some text within it so you just click right click on it you just right click on it and after this you just choose the option that is added text okay you just choose the option that is added text then after that you just write whatever you want to uh, write within it for example you want to write like features available features available so what are the features which are available here what are the features okay yes tell me the features are like you can provide animation within it right this is one of the important feature within this power one slide then transition you can uh, like perform then after that spell check as i have uh, the, like uh, did in case of this now after that uh, what you can do outline tab is here outline tab is there and slide tab is there slide tab is there okay so these are what these are the features which are available in case of this powerpoint slide right 
so what you do for example you want to increase the font of it so you just select the text after that you just increase the font size right and if you want to change the color of it then what you do you just go in this font color option and you just choose the color according to like your choice according to your choice for example you want to choose this color and if you want to justify this content then you just click on this right so it is according to you now for example you want to change the font color of this also so what you do you just choose it and after that you just select the color like whichever you want to fill within this shape right now for example as soon as you will click on f5 function key f5 function key whenever you will press then you can check like these are the number of contents which will be appear onto the screen right and like they are coming uh, like uh, you know the slideshow way but you can check that there is no animation so what you do one by one you just provide the animation within it for example you just provide the animation into this heading part so what you do you just select this heading part and click on animation manual after that you just choose the type of animation for example you want this shape animation within this heading so just click on it so like you can check this is the first thing which will appear onto the screen whenever you will uh, like come into this slide then you just select the content part for example you have choose only that one and after that you are choosing the animation that is fly in so the fly in uh, animation will be applied on this content part right then the third uh, type of animation which you want to provide to, to this shape so what you do you just choose this shape and then you just choose the uh, like slideshow or sorry the animation option right after that you just save it by pressing control s button or by clicking on this file menu and clicking on save button right and after that whenever you will click on f5 button then you can check that it will appear like this one by one it will be appear with the animation with the animation so i think this is the correct way to present uh, your slideshow right now for example uh, like what you want to do for example you want to add one video within it or one audio within it then what you do you just go into this insert insert menu and click on video option right you just click on this video option for adding one video within your powerpoint presentation and after that you just click on video from file okay you just choose the video and after that you just apply it right otherwise what you do if you want to choose any audio then you just click on audio for example i am taking the default audio you just take any uh, default audio for it right and what you do you just save it you just save it by pressing control plus s button otherwise you just go to the file manual and click on save button right and uh, like whenever you will start your slideshow with the help of f5 button then it will uh, like uh, the audio icon will appear on that slide so if you want to present that audio what you do you just click on that audio you just click on that audio right so it will get played <laughs> you do you just stop it right so this is the way to insert the audio and video within your powerpoint presentation i think this is clear to everyone right now what are the other things uh, like which you can do in case of this powerpoint presentation so the next thing uh, is uh, like how to add header and footer within this for example i have added my name within this uh, powerpoint presentation that is made by vanna rawat okay so if you want to add any kind of footer or any kind of header within it then what you do you just go into the insert menu after that you just click on header and footer option and after that you just choose like date and time okay if you want to choose uh, like date and time and you want to fix it then you just click on it and after that like in footer part you want like this made by vanna rawat and you want to include slide numbers also so you just tick mark on that 
and after that you just click on apply to all so all the uh, like number of options will get applied into your powerpoint presentation so what to do you just save it by pressing ctrl plus s by pressing ctrl plus s command after that you just uh, like start your slideshow with the help of f5 function key with the help of f5 function key right and uh, like these are the header and footer which you have added in your presentation that is the date and after that like you have added the slideshow number or the slide number right so these are the things which you can do in your powerpoint presentation slideshow okay so thank you everyone thank you so much